the ability to begin bringing monitoring, as we call it, into the home, we believe could fundamentally change the way that both patients are treated as well as drugs are developed. That was Elizabeth Holmes in 2005, one of the few times early on that she spoke publicly about her ambitions. I think it all starts with a very unique kind of founder who truly has a passionate burning conviction that they've come up with an idea that will change the world. Uh, and they have the soaring ambition to just be driven to want to make it happen as fast as possible. Conviction spurred Holmes to drop out of Stanford University. In 2003, the 19-year-old traded in life as a full-time undergrad for life as a full-time CEO. I'd always believed that the purpose of building something, building a company, is to make a difference in the world. And I got to the point in which I, I found what I felt like I was born to do.